Let any point on the given curve be x, y. Therefore, the distance between the point A0 and x, y on the curve is equal to square root of x minus a whole square plus y minus 0 whole square which is equal to square root of x minus a whole square plus y square. Let's denote this distance by s. Therefore, s square is equal to x minus a whole square plus y square. Now we know from the equation of the curve that y square is equal to 2x minus 2x square. Substituting this value of y square, s square is equal to x minus a whole square plus 2x minus 2x square. Now let's denote s square by t. Clearly, s is maximum or minimum when t, which is equal to s square, is maximum or minimum. The maximum or minimum value of t is reached when the derivative of t with respect to x is equal to 0. Or in other words, 2 times x minus a plus 2 minus 4x is equal to 0. This implies that 2x is equal to 2 minus 2a or x is equal to 1 minus a. To determine whether this is a maximum or a minimum, we evaluate the second derivative of t with respect to x, which is equal to 2 minus 4, which is equal to minus 2, which is negative. Therefore, t, which is equal to s square, is maximum when x is equal to 1 minus a. which implies that the distance s reaches its maximum when x is equal to 1 minus a. s is given by the expression square root of x minus a whole square plus y square, which is 2x minus 2x square. When x is equal to 1 minus a, this is equal to square root of 1 minus a minus a whole square plus 2 minus 2a minus 2 times in brackets 1 minus a whole square. This is equal to square root of 1 minus 2a whole square plus 2 minus 2a minus 2 times in brackets 1 minus 2a plus a square. 2 cancels and the maximum value of s simplifies to square root of 1 minus 4a plus 4a square minus 2a plus 4a minus 2a square. 4a cancels and therefore the maximum value of the distance is equal to square root of 1 minus 2a plus 2a square.